four. And we have liftoff. Welcome to the Oliver and Lucas Kids. Today, we're at the Museum of the Moon to learn about the moon. Yeah! The Museum of the Moon is an artwork of the moon created by Luke Jerram, a very talented artist from the United Kingdom. This artwork is so popular that it travels around the world for people to see and today is our lucky day because it has come to Bunjil Place. This 7 metre wide replica of the moon has been lit up from the inside with lights. The surface of the moon replica is using real life images taken of the moon with a NASA satellite. Did you know that the moon we see lighting up our sky at night is actually a dusty ball of rock? It is roughly a quarter of the size of Earth. Although the moon shines bright in the night sky, its surface is actually dark. We see the moon light up only because it is reflecting light from the sun. The temperature on the moon is super hot during the day and super cold at night. Like Earth, the moon has gravity. Gravity is the force that pulls things towards the ground. But the gravity on the moon is weaker to the strength of the gravity on Earth. Did you know that the moon's gravity controls the rise and fall of water levels in our oceans? The first person to walk on the moon was Neil Armstrong. Notice that as it gets darker, the Museum of the Moon shines brighter like the real moon in the night sky. We asked Elfie what he thought the holes in the moon were, and this was his response. Little holes are cheese. Holes on the moon are the cheese. They look like cheese. Good try, Elfie, but the moon actually has craters because asteroids, meteorites, and comets have crashed into the moon's surface. There are also mountains and hardened lava from dead volcanoes. Did you know that the moon is Earth's best friend? That's because the moon orbits our planet over and over again by circling our Earth in an oval shape called an ellipse. It takes just over 27 days for the moon to travel all the way around the Earth and complete its orbit. Ever notice how the moon looks like it changes shape each night? That's because as the moon orbits the Earth, the sun lights up different parts of its surface. So it's just our view of the moon that's changing, not the actual shape of the moon. It's time for us to go. We hope you enjoyed learning about the moon today. Don't forget to click the like button and subscribe to our channel for more educational videos for kids. See you next time. Bye.